Okay. I'm Liv. I'm Townsend. I'm Barnaby. I'm gonna play Shovel Knight. Yep. Yeah. I'm gonna play Shovel Knight. <laughs> yeah, baby. She's very excited. I love this game so much. Holy, it. Wow, you played the video game. Yeah. You certainly played the video game. Yeah. Mm. It's time for a new adventure. It's gonna be... No, no I can't. I'm sorry, I can't. I love this game too much. I can't! I can't not! We're going legit! It's my name. It's my actual name. This is how much I love this game. I'm putting my actual name instead of a jokey thing here. Yeah. Alright. Look at that! Um, it starts no one's gonna question you. I will. So this is the story of Shovel Knight, for those who don't know. This is Shovel Knight, and this is Shield Knight. Long ago, the lands won tamed and roamed by legendary adventurers. These, these adventures are legendary, I have a shirt of both of them. So yeah, Shovel Knight's great, and uh, Shovel Knight's Jumbo's best friend, Shield Knight. Friend. Just yeah. Friend. Yeah, friend. But unfortunately, some bullshit happens in a place called the Tower of Fate, and oh fuck. What appears to be evil samurai ninja warriors attack and shit gets raw. That is a fucking raw screenshot, by the way. But this is the actual story. And then he becomes a broken man and just goes farming for the rest of his life. Except you probably don't do it. But then unfortunately, this very interesting looking enchantress turns up with the Order of No Quarter. Uh, and they're a bunch of evil knights. Except they're uh, very evil, super evil. In almost, like, unredeemable. They're totally not redeemable. Yet. So, do you know what? Shovel Knight's back. He's gonna kick the shit out of all. So, in reality, instead of, like, going into a life of solitude, he maybe would have spent, like, a year or two. Don't worry about that. Inside I'm getting digging. So, there. Yeah, we're gonna play Shovel Knight. I'm gonna remember the controls. It's been a long time. Woo! Have you both played Shovel Knight? I've played it better. I have not. I've only watched the gameplay of it. Uh, who did you watch play it? I watched Game Grumps play it. Um, well, I'm watching them play it together. And uh, what are you liking thus far about it? What sort of stuff like, intrigued you about the game? Because I believe uh, you're the one who helped suggest that we should play this, which I'm very grateful for. Um, I really like the style of the game. I like the fact that it's a 2D scroller. I think the story is really good. Um, from what I've seen of it so far, because Game Rocks haven't finished playing it yet. Um, I like the mechanics of it. I think it's the mechanics of it. Yes. And um, I just think it's quite different because obviously it, it's a knight that fights with a shovel. Uh, yes. Like, so, uh, as you say, right. Shovel Knight is about a guy who's a knight with a shovel, and that's genuinely it. Yeah, and everyone's all like. Or like you meet loads of people in town and shit, and you're just sort of, and they're all just like, oh, but you you only have a shovel. Your puny shovel can do nothing. And then he just goes and beats the shit out of the shovel. And it's just like, uh, so okay. Shovel Knight is a as we may have gathered, uh, is a game about Shovel Knight with the shovel, and the gameplay is reminiscent of not only classic uh, uh, NES and that SNES games, but like there's specific things like yeah. the it's shovel inspired by like two major games, Duck Tent. DuckTales and Mega Man. Mm. The Mega Man aspect is clear in like, the side-scrolling platforming stuff and some specific puzzles we'll see later. And the DuckTales thing is because of this. When you jump and press down with shovel, you can bounce on your shovel on certain things. Yeah, I will do it now. You can't break this, but you can break checkpoints in this game. If you're feeling bold... What happens if you break a checkpoint? You get, uh, ca you get cash sometimes. Or different things. You get a bunch of like cash lines. But you lose the checkpoint. So you have to be very good at the video game to feel cocky enough to do it. Because all I know is um, in Game Run, just every so often, like, they hit it and then Aaron's just like, don't, don't hit that, don't hit that. Whether or not it was him or Danny who hit the checkpoint first, Aaron's yeah, all awesome. instantly like, don't, don't hit that, don't hit that. It's like, okay. I don't know why he shouldn't hit it, but um, now I do. Yeah, they're save points, basically. And you can, of course, keep them alive if you want to you know, be okay and not die. Or, you can do the other thing and uh, play risky business, if you like, by uh, breaking them. No, um, they, they need the checkpoints because I'm pretty confident Danny just flings himself off cliffs sometimes on purpose to piss off Aaron. 
Which is always quite entertaining. But. Well, that's Bubble Dragon. I love you, Bubble Dragon. Don't change. It's fine. Don't worry about it. We've got this. I've played Shovel Knight. I've played about one bit. Sorry, I've just got to throw these skeletons at the skeleton now. He had a bad, he had a very bad time with it, poor bastard. Uh, yeah, so I've been playing Shovel Knight a while ago. I haven't played the DLC yet, which, for those who don't know, is a Plague of Shadows, which lets you play as another character. Um, but, Shovel Knight, like, I consider, like, it was one of my favourite games, which is why I played it. Absolutely. 110%. This is adorable, this is great, this is actually well written for a fucking 2D game about a guy with a shovel. Please. Please- OH NO! I got spooked by jelly! Fucking jelly. What the fuck I Uh, genuinely I've had terrible times where I've realised I've eaten too much jelly, and it's caused me problems. My life is a- is a cavalcade- There's a soup there. There it is. You- you stop. I will, I will be over here. Because I need to collect the Jake Kaufman music! Because Jake Kaufman, the composer of this game, is in this game talking about how great his music is. We will get to Jake Kaufman in the next book. Oh, oh. I can get the music. I, I, I know everything. I, I got it all. So, no death run. Perfect. Every day. I was really scared of those spikes, they so want to go back. Oh yeah, they instant kill one. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, spikes in this game instant kill just like Mega Man! This game tra takes true to its references. If you are on spikes, you will die badly. You will not be good. You will not have a very good time on those spikes. These dragons, even though you can bounce on them and kill them, are adorable. I'm not sure where you want to Maybe because they hurt you? Yeah. Oh, oh, I can do it. I can do it. I just have to believe in the heart of cards. I believe in the heart of cards! It paid, it paid off for everyone. I did it. I won. You I did. Won. I won, really. This is my big thing. Some people have Dang and Ron, but I have this. We don't. We don't have Dang and Ron. We do. We're, we're trying to conceptualize Dang and Ron. Also, just like classic like Castlevania looking chickens. Chickens will give you the help. In the original Castlevania, you could break walls and there will be chickens. Alright. Because, you know, in ancient, like, vampire ridden castles, chicken is usually placed within the walls for safekeeping. Because they don't know what fridges are, vampires. Which is problematic because they don't really help with the whole blood thing. No, yeah, no. Good, Good job! Uh, I do need to get good. I love this game too much. Okay. Oh, fucking hilarious. It was. Oh, they're past the controller, too. I'm keeping the controller. What the fuck are you doing? No death run, guys. No it's all good. She hasn't died. Let's go. I'm getting used to the controls, basically. Just avoid the slime. Leave the one. Sticky. Why? Why? Fuck it. Kill it like that. Oh, oh, fuck this one. Body that's one. Be the shit out of it. Look at those secrets. Trying to get down there. This is. This is. Considering what just happened. This is. Fine. Okay. Fine. Nobody died. Not the Jake Kaufman music. That's all that matters. Hey. David. Turns out I can play the video game. I just have to actually play the video game. Oh my god, I actually have to try. Um, there we go. Upwards we go. Now see, this looks like a secret now, though. And you could say it that is, but it also has some very, uh, if I remember right, some inspiration mode. Yeah, it did! Oh, I'm entirely wrong. I'm just mostly. Oh, Shovel Knight, how am I this game? The, the opening theme of the Plains of Passage is one of my favourite themes in the entire game. How do you get that much? Uh, oh, absolutely right. One moment. Yep. So cool, just uh, slightly more well hidden. 
Yeah. But that's still there. There's always a place where they are. It's also a chat. That, you're absolutely right. This game is very good at indicating. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Getting around to school teaches a lot of things. I remember right, it told me how many times can John can't say the end word in a video before he gets fired. Turns out there was all Well, the limit should have been one. The limit should have been one, but fortunately, it was not. I'm not even sure why that dragon was doing nothing wrong. I'm the evil. I'm the evil. Yep. It was me all along. Yeah. Thing though, really, in this, isn't it? Yeah, like, yeah, I remember the dragon. Oh, little bastard. Ooh. Yeah, for that reason. Good job. Yeah, no, it's been a while. But yeah, no, I, I remember that dragon specifically did the right bonds. There's a, there's, a, there's a bit where you realise this is designed to kill you in a certain way. Yeah, you beat it and then you fall down that pit. Like, oh. Then you have to beat it again. Ooh. Ooh. Come on, Skull. I'm not very good at platformers, I don't know if you know this. There's a marathon I did get free shovel mate. Well, I did. It's alright. We do, as a society, we do not celebrate success, we celebrate failure in the worst form. For it's what makes us human. You ever celebrated one of your failures? Right. What failure have you celebrated? Uh, I don't know. Uh, well, I celebrated when uh, I won. Like, I didn't celebrate with other people, but I celebrated my first game of um, Street Fighter when I played it and I actually felt like I won something. I felt like... That's not a failure, though. For me it was, because I didn't win, but I uh, I still learned something. Yeah, like, so you learned something which isn't a failure. You could also, by the way, use the hitbox of the shovel to uh, get your stuff back. You can. Oh, you can do that! I can. And lose a tiny bit more! I can, but Great. I killed the dragon, so it actually gave me just the fact that it was uh, yeah. very good. So, when have you celebrated an actual failure, Liv? Um, so, like, what do you count as an actual failure? Then? That, that's my question. I've not totally sure. Not necessarily something you exactly celebrate. Um, okay. Um, something that's classified as an actual failure. Okay, an event where uh, something happened and either a nothing good came about. It's like failing an exam that's an actual failure. Um, Okay. Um, when have you celebrated a failure? Uh, okay. Like, uh, if we talk about like, tests or something like that. Like, it doesn't have to specifically be tests. Tests is just the example I have because it's the only thing I think of. Well, uh, I'm, I'm glad you're asking about that. Uh, I... When I think about it, it's been very difficult to celebrate failure because I always... Like, while I joke about it, I always feel like if I failed, that was on me, and I should feel bad about it. I should feel like I failed, because otherwise I... By the way, I, uh, you're going to have to give me a second. But so, by the way, whenever you celebrate a failure, you're going to have to give me a minute! I don't think I really have. Yeah, you don't celebrate I could, failures. I could say I celebrated small victories, which would be perhaps closer to... Uh, what about that time that you perfected, uh, perfected the best of you still lost the game? 
that was still not no, necessarily that's, that's a failure, that yeah, was a victory, victory in some sense. Because that was an event uh, where something positive happened, like he, he perfected him. One of the best players on the planet. But um, oh, by the way, story. What? Hey, buddy. Hey, friend. Oh, I've got a shirt of him as well. The Cerulean Coward. That's fucking amazing, man. Don't make a shirt of him. There's nothing here for you anymore except your shitty platform. Shut up. I can platform. I made it through this game. I have to go back. <sighs> Your time all the way has dulled your senses. Clearly it has, because I'm falling down pits. This entire valley has been conquered by the Enchantress. I don't see much conquest. I don't see much of it. Well, um, that's what all the enemies are for. Knights in the Order of No Quarter. That matters, but it ain't one after the Enchantress has to go through me. Steal thy shovel! literally just your rival. Yes. So we'll say use as a shovel. Yeah. But but he's got fireballs and he does. He does. You can get fireballs. Yeah. You can get the I don't know if you actually can, but I'm pretty sure you can. Yeah you can get fireballs. Oh I just realized I'm shot. Well a little bit. Don't get hit. <laughs> Not God damn it, if Barnaby has to beat like blue knights in one hit just by using his shoe, you gotta do it then. Come on. That's right. I'll get it this time. Yeah, well you gotta back that. Yeah, just everyone just laugh at them. It's not like it's a counter. But yeah, that's a cool boss fight. And it has good music. Do the dive kick a bit more when you get the chance. Yeah, no, it's, it's been a long time. I know. Such a disappointment to the channel. I might have to the name. It's the first boss! Yeah, and it's been a long time. I'm also st uh, I've also lost my build to use the uh, dive properly. Oh. 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 Two 
Come on in. Come on. Come on. Yeah! You did it. I apologize for my shot then, but hey, that's, that's me to a team. I'm going to go talk to Jake Cartman. And then... Look at the back. It's like, nah, fuck it. this shit, I'm out. See ya. Nah, boss. Nah, man. man. Fuck you. Get some rest. Get some rest. Oh no. Oh! Oh no, please! Catch your girlfriend! The, the feels are hitting me again. It's been a long time. Catch your girlfriend. This is like, oh. What happens if you don't catch her? I would never not. This game never made me want to not catch her. Yeah, As I get I'm... that. I'm just wondering, like, what happens if you don't? Well, guess what? If I'm on controls, we'll never find out. That what girl's getting caught. What I never miss? miss. What happens if we make her miss one way? If you make me miss, I mean to be very, very vexed. On a level you will not wish to see. But we shall go talk to the whole, to the people of the town. Ah! No weapons! No, it's just a shovel. <laughs> Who is no, 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 I just murdered a person with my shovel. Come back, person. This is very Zelda 2, by the way. Sparkles rising from the bottomless pit. Grab that shit if you can. I'm gonna talk to the horse person. It's a secret. Ram will keep going to the left first. What? Go to the left first and Ram will keep. Hey, Jay Kaufman! Or Bard? I'm but a simple Bard, fuck you. But I have a big problem. You need to strength. I lost all my music sheets, my entire record while I scan across land, and give my music sheet returning to me, I should reward you. And I have two J. Cartman musics. So what will we get? I found a rival. Black Knight has fine musical taste. Should have studied composition. Uh, yes, we have. I like this film, but we have plenty of song. We have play just Oh. Have a uh, plain pot. Right. We haven't got the main theme yet. Oh wait, we do. So strike the up is my favourite theme in the entire. And he starts playing it on this little thing as well. But um, yeah, strike the up is my favourite theme in this entire game. Hello, Molly. I have a pretty face. It's a helmet. I have a pretty face. Thanks, Mom. Hey, bud. Maximum health will increase if you eat. Bring a meal ticket. So if you buy a meal ticket, you can get an increase and stuff. So, go to him as I think the one who can give you meal tickets. Uh, yes. I don't know if we can get more than one of them. So what we're gonna do is we go up here. Nice. And we got some. Help. No, you, you go back and get another one. Look, what are you doing? Oh. oh! It's only. Oh right, I can play it. Okay, so what? Get that tornado. Good. Nice, more health. I'm gonna need that. And if I dance as acolytes, it's the, this person right here, the dancer. If someone could defeat him, I will bestow upon them my greatest treasure. Let's keep an eye out for him. Well, there's many the king of nothing. So this is the king of Pride Mall Keep, but he's no longer the king, because uh, King Knight fucking stole his name. What a shit. What a shit! What a shit, that King Knight. Grandmother's Swamp. Double trouble tool and shovel, my bird eye knows who uses them both. Excavation, the number of dig piles you dug is seven. And the amount of nausea, the amount of gold you collected is 6132. Barla So we died eight times. I'm very bad. We haven't played long, but hopefully, uh, thank you for helping me, kindly witch. I'm not a witch! I'm just a grandmother. Oh, there's this bored lady. She's cool. Mona, I forgot. What's on to you? Let's have some fun. Oh, it's 
It's all about basically hitting these things against stuff. I've never really been able to play this game right, but I just do it for one reason. Look at those jumps. I didn't realize I was on the last side, too. Ooh! Ooh! Yeah, no, no, it's okay. I'm not. She's wasting so many of her motions. I am. Good job. Take this and come back and get bored again. Apparently good enough. Cool. Yeah. I'm content with that. No, that's what I remember, right? There's someone from the right over here. Yeah. And you notice, there's also Secret J. Kaufman! Hey, show me. I know things are tough, but don't throw in the towel. That king knight, you give him an inch, he thinks he's a ruler. Mm. I fucking love this game. <laughs> I tried with some horse adventurers, but they were all so negative. Oh man. Hey, it's the true block. It's a puns thing. It's a puns thing. We don't have enough. We don't. We do need that. I want to just talk over here and see how much we need. Hey boy guy, you won't believe the merchandise. Oh. We need that. But we've got Jay Kaufman. So let's go to Jay Kaufman. They change it in and see how much they give us. Because uh, we need that fishing rod post haste. Yeah. Hey Jay! Uh, uh, 500! That might be enough. Okay, that's actually what we need to do Just give me a song. Is the town thing. Okay, cool. So we gotta go grab the thing and then we're gonna be done for this yep. episode. I'm sorry I'm so terrible at Shovel Knight, but it's a lot of fun and I definitely recommend you all play this at some point. So we gotta buy the fishing rod. Oh no, we're not! We got. Oh no! Five shot. Look, gets blown up on the screen. Yep. This episode was Look, gets blown up on the stream. I'm the stream. And I'm Wolf. I'm Hansen. I'm Barnaby. And this is Shovel Knight.